After downloading the NLIS Exchange software, we can double click on the zip file and we find three files in there a quick start guide PDF, a setup.exe, or uh, an MSI file. We can simply click on the MSI file and the program will begin to install. If we get a security warning box pop up, just click run. We can now go through the process of installing. Click next and click next again to confirm. Once a box comes up that says installation complete, we can close that and we're ready to begin. To start the NLIS Exchange program, simply double click on the shortcut. A box comes up that asks you to register. We can skip this for now, but you will need to register for, before the end of the 30 day trial period. Uh, registration is free. Once we click the right arrow, uh, you'll be able to see three boxes. One to select animals, one for history of your transactions, and one to configure your setup. To start off with, we need to configure the setup. I need to put in a, an NLIS logon, username, and an NLIS logon password. So we'll do that now. We're also able to put in a default PIC. I'll type in a default PIC. This would typically be your own PIC number. Also, we can put in uh, further PICs, which might be PICs uh, of of people that we regularly use uh, to transfer cattle from or to. I'll add a couple here. We can put in a name uh, so that uh, we can easily refer to whose uh, pick it is. and I'll add another one. Once that's done, we'll just click OK. The system is now configured. Now if we want to send some animals to the NLIS, we simply select the Select Animals icon. A list appears on the left hand side of the screen, which gives us all of our sessions. Um, some of these may be from MyScale Pro, if we were using uh, the older version of software, um, or uh, from APS Office, if we are using the new version of software, APS Office 2.1 or indeed a TSI. I'll select a file and I can drag it across to the right hand pane and the right hand pane will be populated with the list of tags. You can see here that all of these tags have been pre-selected 1155 animals in total. Uh, I can choose just to send some by deselecting them all and then choosing the ones that I want to send. For now I'll just send three animals I'll click the first three and click the right hand arrow. I've got some options here as to how I want the information sent to the NLIS. Uh, we're cited, which is a, a new thing for animals uh, coming into um, field days or showgrounds or camp drafts for instance. 
uh, transferring onto or off property which is one that would be typically used for moving animals onto or off a property died on property had an electronic ID replaced or being notified to the NLIS as a third party producer transfer or being notified as deceased by a third party the most typical transaction would be the transferring onto or off your property so I'll click on that notice it has the pick number that I put in earlier and I can drop this box down and put in the picks that I selected earlier uh, into the move to pick I could also change that to the move from pick could be one of these and the move to pick could be my pick for now I'll just select Bob I can put in an NVD or waybill number uh, I don't have to though so I can leave that blank and the date of transfer I, there's a calendar here where I can select, select a different date click on the right hand arrow and it asks me to confirm those three animals to send to the NLIS once I'm happy with that I can click on the right hand arrow again and we will attempt to connect to the database and send that information to the database the animals have now been sent successfully to the database after sending our details to the NLIS we can look at our history here we can see those three animals that have been transferred and if I click on those I can see those actual three animals we can also show details of the transaction if at any time you need some help on the program there is a help button which will tell you about the screen that you're in also there is a quick start guide that comes with the program to help you get the most out of the NLIS exchange software. Should you need further help please don't hesitate to call us on 1800 425 524